Alright, hey everybody, this is Robo Z Gamer. Welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. And you might be wondering, what what's happening here? What happened? Well, uh huh. Yeah, sorry. Uh, what happened was, is I was trying to go all the way over to the left here until this old woman stopped me. Freeze! You two, not another step. Don't come this way. Some complete jerk just bumped into me and made me lose my a contact lens. I'll, I'm looking for it right now, so don't you dare move. Unfortunately, the only way to do this is to move. You hear me? Whatever you do, do not move an inch. Not an inch, you hear? You have to move. Idiot, you stepped on it! My poor contact lens! I told you not to move! Don't your stupid ears work? What were you thinking? Mm -mm. This is your fault. Now I have to buy a new contact lens. But you're gonna pay for it! Compensate me, Mr. Clumsy! No. Fine, if that's your plan, then here's mine, you oaf. If I'm gonna block the gate to the west side until you bring me a new contact lens. Biatch. Let me through, god... Damn it. Mmm. God, what a jerk. I mean, come on. Alright, let's go ahead and talk to this guy here. He'll have us he'll he'll order a contact lens. Be sure you do this. Other otherwise, if you do it later, then you're gonna be doing a couple chapters or so. No, I'm not ending the video here. I'm just saving. Yeah, I've been trying to mess around with the quality of my vids, and I figured out why my video looked so crappy before. Whoops, pardon me, sucker! Hey, what's your beef, pal? Yeah, I'm talking to you! Mario, you gotta wake up. That guy just stole half your coins. No, he didn't. See? <laughs> that is so lame. Ugh, I hate this town. Actually, a lot of people say to do this. Oh, now, wait, oh, uh, yeah, okay. Anyway, uh, a lot of people say to go spend your coins right here. No, you're not supposed to do that. What you can do is go back here, and you'll find the bandit inside this house. Talk to the a-hole, and he'll give you your coins back. Ew, so fancy meeting you here. You're pretty name persistent, buddy. What a pain. Fine, fine, okay, you got me. I'll give you your coins back. Here. Yay. And a star piece. Yay. Well, that's our very first star piece. Alright, let's get going. Well, yeah, we are moving. And I'd like to add that right here, there is a wall that looks like it transitions. If you go behind it, there's nothing of interest here. Oh, wait, there's a star piece. Aha! I got it! Yeah. Then, you have a level up shop. This is where the shine sprites come in. Which I didn't talk about, but I'll say them anyways. Uh, yes, I'm now using Action Replay. With the Action Replay, I can level up Goombella right here and now, but shine sprites are used to level up partners. This is Merlin, he'll do that for you. Alright. Yes, power up this partner. Shafidi! Shazubi! Uh, for some reason, I like this transition. It's funny looking. It's like we're in limbo. Sparkly! Anywho. Then you may go. Oh my god, are these like incented candles? Oh my god. What's wrong with me? Alright. Well, anyway, over here there's an a-hole named Gus who will make you pay will make you pay in order to um, pass, but uh, unfortunately, you, but unfortunately, if you, but unfortunately, you have to pay ten coins. Yeah, that's a pretty, that's a pretty hefty price, if you ask me. All right, we're gonna go in here. This is where Frankly should be. Oh, hi, there you are, Professor Frankly. What's up? Who's there? Who wants me? Ew. Ah, yes, you. Now, you, uh, I've seen your face before. Yes, that face. Wait for just a moment. Don't tell me now. Silence. I'll get it right. Mm, it's not Gumbriel. 
Er det ikke lige så dum? Jeg er skæn. Ah, I got it. Your Goomba aren't you? You were at my archaeology class last year, am I right? Wow, yes, sir. That's me. I'm Goombella. Junior, you Goom. Go Goombas. Of course I remember you. Not to toot my own horn, but I'm good at remembering things. You, though, you stuck out in my mind because you're such an exceptional student. Uh, why else does she stick in her mind? And that guy behind you is... Mario! Ho! Mario. M Professor, he's Mario. You know, the famous one. Oh, my apologies. I'm such a bookworm, I haven't a clue about what's hip right now. In any case, what sort of errand brings you two to all the way to a place like this? We're in hoping you'd tell us about the legendary treasure said to be below Rogueport. We thought if anyone knew anything about it, it'd be you. You would, Professor, frankly. Of course I know about it. The reason I came here was to study that very subject. He's got a lot of books. Why do you types want to learn about the legendary treasure? You know that most say it's little more than a fairy tale, don't you? Archaeologists and historians have to search for truth in those fairy tales, though. Me, I believe the legendary treasure truly does exist, and I really want to find it. Good point, and well made. In that case, I'll cooperate with you however I can. First of all, about the treasure. There are many mysteries surrounding it. Some say it's an in in infinitely vast treasure hoard, while others say it's a magical item. Some books that say it's actually a monster, while still others claim it's an empty chest. So many different theories. Obviously, it's impossible to, div to, to divine the truth among them. But all agree on one point. To find the treasure, one must have the crystal stars. To find the treasure of yore, take the criven take the seven crystal stars, whoops, to the thousand-year door. You mean the crystal stars in the old saying that super elderly people pass down? Indeed, the same. As the saying goes, if you want to find the legendary treasure, you must first collect the seven crystal stars. Hold the magic of my apple off before the entrance to the thousand-year door. Then the stars will light the way... Uh, that leads to the stones of yesterday. Yeah. A lot of the lore I've read says that if this magical map is taken to the doorway, then it'll show where to find the crystal stars. A correct, and the thousand years old supposedly they're here, deep beneath this town. Yet the critical piece of the puzzle, the magical map, is lost. If only we had that map. But we do have a professor, or, well, not we exactly. Mario has the magical map. What? Really? Could you, could you actually have it? Could I just take a quick look if you don't mind? <laughs> Astounding! This is it! The real thing! The one and only magical map! Not my hero, you're great, wonderful, fantastic, blah 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 blah! Alright, so in the next vid, we are going to go down to the Thousand Years Door. Hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you soon. Bye bye!